So I'm making a video here, guys, and there's a dude here, right over there, and uh, I don't know, he's like recording me, or he's, he's asking me what I'm recording about, so I don't know what this dude's problem is. Uh, <laughs> Hey guys, it's really dark out here, but uh, I'm just going to get away from that fucking guy, because uh, honestly, this is getting fucking freaky. I'm down a dark road, and uh, hold on, this dude, here I got a light, but there's a light up here, get this fucking dog away from me, look at this shit, this guy's got dogs out here, so I just came down. Park my car and uh, oh my god, fucking adrenaline is pumping. <sighs> Let me just get in this light here because fuck it, it's a free country. I can stand on a country road if I want to. So I'm gonna just keep an eye out. There's fucking dogs like everywhere around here. I can hear what the fuck do you want, dog? Get the fuck out of here. I'm just walking down a fucking road. <laughs> Fuck you! Little shit eater. So hey. This, this guy. Came out of the fucking darkness. <clears throat> Sorry, guys. I'm a little shook up, man. I can't believe this shit is happening here. This is crazy. I walk down this road. And granted, it is kind of weird to just see some random person walking, but... I walk past him, I have my shit on, as you can see. Sorry, I'll turn this off, I think he's gone. And if he doesn't, fuck him. He can be in the video too. Um, hold on, let me just position myself. Fuck it, it's so dark out here, guys, sorry. Um, basically, <sighs> I, parked the car, I parked the car a little ways away, and, uh, um, And then I put all my gear on when I walk down here uh, with my backpack, dressed all in black, pretty much. Different glasses on than I normally wear. And I got my hood on, my hat on. So I'm pretty well covered my face-wise. And, and I never wear these glasses anymore. But yeah, I, I parked, oh man, about like three minutes up the road. And some nice little, regular little suburban subdivision kind of place parked my car had a cigarette lit up a cigarette and jumped out and came down and i just turned on the road where the jehovah's witness is and this fucking guy came out of the darkness i'm gonna walk back there just fuck these guys they, they think they can just this guy started asking me questions and shit i was like he's first he shone this big ass flashlight bright as fuck shone it in my eye and I said, whoa, dude, just turn the fucking light off, man. Just walk in here. And, uh, you know, I don't give a fuck about this fucking cunt. Anyway, um, I said, is that your dog? Because the guy was like, oh, uh, you all right? Which over here means, like, can I help you with something? So I walked back down the end of the road, almost to the end of the road. And there's like a little a little cow place where you feed your cows. Now I'm back in like a regular subdivision. Oh, man, scary shit. That's the fucking road I came down. There's the moon. Um, just out here. It's pretty quiet now, but dude was like right here with, with one dog was next to him. He came up out of nowhere, shone this bright light on me. And then I didn't say shit to him. After I was like, hey, turn your fucking light off, man. I'm just walking here. And uh, then what he did was uh, I, I then I just walked past. And uh, then he had another dog. It was Oh, here he comes again, I think. Oh, no, there's another dude coming down the road. So, yeah, there's I'm creating like a big, there's, for some reason, this is creating like a big commotion around here but i don't think they have much of a leg to stand on because i'm just walking out here you know this guy so I, 
I walk up to the end of this dark road and I'm sitting there. Uh, so when I started, re as soon as I started recording, the motherfucker showed up out of the darkness with his light again. And he's like, hey, you're on my property. And you guys probably saw that part. And uh, he's like, you mind if I ask what you're making a video of? That's what I walked away from. Because I said, I don't have to tell you shit. <laughs> and uh, I said, no, I'm not going to tell you what I'm making a video on. And uh, yeah, dude, this is like intimidating, man. Fucking dogs and shit. I was like, hey, is this your dog? Because he was walking a little further back. I'm just walking up to this fucking place again, but there's no way I'm spray painting this shit tonight, you guys. Because I'll get fucked. Then I'm then I'm fucked. Because then I'm in trouble. Because then I actually did something illegal. So I'm gonna have to call off the fucking. This is crazy though. It just goes to show you. I'll do a little a little recording in front of their place. Here it is. Here I'm back here now at the Jehovah's Witness place again. And. Uh, that car is actually, yeah, it's still there. It's still in the same place. There's fucking lights on. He's got a motion detector, too. As you can see, that just flashed on. Um, which is convenient, because I'll just stand here and make the rest of this video. So, yeah. This, he's got, like, there's the car. It's the same fucking plates. This is the place where I chased him the first time. And uh, this is getting fucking creepy. So I'm gonna get the fuck out of here and go have a beer. Because uh, these fuckers are crazy, man. Anyway, I have to go to a plan B. The adventure continues. Luckily, I didn't. I'm glad to. Fucking glad I didn't, like, do any shit with eggs or any other shit. Because, obviously, they've got followers up in this town. Um, there's that street again. This is where I am. It's probably completely fucking dark. <laughs> As you can see, there's cars passing by, you know. I can't imagine. I even asked some older couple at the Gaelic football pitch. We call it a pitch. I asked them if they knew that there was a Jehovah's Witness place up here, but they were from another town, total other direction, so they were just going to a, a match to see their kid play or something. Because they got like older high school kind of uh, playoffs and, and there's all kinds of shit going on with the GAA right now, but I'm just walking back to my car, guys, and I gotta say, <laughs> this is fun as shit, but man, Everybody who's been commenting my, in my section saying all the shit I heard, I can't believe it's fucking true. I can't believe they have this kind of network and they're so fucking paranoid. It's just fucking weird asking me all these questions. Like, I can walk. <laughs> I don't have to say shit. You're not a cop. Like, what the fuck, dude? I mean, it's, it's looser over here. Like, you have a lot of rights, you know. We got just, like, same kind of rights as, as America. And even more in a lot of ways because we don't really have a lot of cops. You know, the cops are cool here. They're, they're down in numbers. Um, and, you know, <clears throat> so they don't like, they won't just respond to some bullshit and they certainly won't re entertain, I wouldn't think, the fucking Jehovah's Witness witnesses, because I don't know if they be. I don't think they do that kind of shit. They have real jobs, like in real society. They just kind of shut themselves off, like on that creepy fucking road that I was apparently on the guy's land. I'm like, <laughs> well, a move off my land, and that's. Uh, I said, a move off your little cow entrance. It's where they like drop the hay for the cow. There's this little uh, chunk, little entrance into the field. It's tiny little. It's not even a. You can't walk any further. It's just like a big barrier there. And they open that up to feed. So maybe he was just a farmer, but he certainly asked a lot of fucking questions and he was pretty persistent. You know, I don't know. Anyway, one hell of a night. Ariel X signing off. Talk to you guys on the flip side. Thanks so much.